Hello everyone, welcome to Shortcut Tutorials. In this video, we are going to see that how can we add a fade in and fade out text in Shortcut. So here I have a video clip uh, in my Shortcut that I have already added and I want to add some text to this video clip. So if I just play this video from the very first frame, you will see that it is above them. So one text to this video clip to make it much more interesting to watch. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to add a text with a sit, uh, slight bit of animation. So let's see how do we do that in today's video. First of all, right click here, go to track operations and click on add video track. Here what we are going to do is add our text. So click on open other, click on text and here we can type any text that you want. Since this is a video of mountains, so I'm just going to type mountains, but you can type anything that relates to your video or anything that you want to be shown click on ok now you will see that uh, some mountains text is now showing now let's just wait for a few seconds for it to load the video properly so now uh, you can uh, see that the text is generated successfully on top of our video it may take a few seconds if it is not generating even after a few seconds then you can just click on this plus button over here to bring the text onto your video now using this slider you can increase or decrease the duration of this text and as you can see we have added a transparent text that means the background of our video would be visible at all times to us which is exactly what we want next we will be getting is a text wizard wherein we can just change the font size as we want so suppose you click over here right now the size is 60 if you want you can just increase or decrease the size i want to increase it to 72 and here i can see the preview as well if you want to change the font also that also you can do if you want to change the style that also you can do if you want to add a custom size let's say 120 so that also we can apply once you're satisfied with the changes click on ok to apply those changes once your text is applied then what you can do is just you can click on this plus icon to see that how your video is looking if you want to change the position of the text just using this circle option you can just change its position to wherever you seem that uh, the text is looking okay so this is where i want to keep my text that is just between the two mountains now to get rid of the box what you want to do is just uh, in the timeline click on the second track that is the second video track so it will get rid of all the boxes that we have but for now what we are going to do is we are going to go back to the first track because we want to add the fade in text effect so what we're going to do is make sure that our clip is selected the text is selected it would be selected with the red lines all around it and when the red box or the box is shown over here go to the filters click on this plus icon and search for fade in Fade in video is the effect we want to see. Just click on that. And now if you play it from the very first frame. So this is how it is looking. Black color text is uh, slowly fading into white, which is not very good looking. So just check on this box that says adjust opacity instead of fade with black. Now let's just go to the very first frame and check that how our uh, text is looking now. So this is how it is looking. It is slowly fading in, which is exactly what we wanted. Now let us adjust the duration of the text to the whole duration of the video. Then we want to add another filter. So again click on this plus icon and now select fade out. So again fade out video is the option we are going to go for. In this fade out video again just check this box that says adjust opacity instead of fade with black. And again you can preview your video to just see that how it is looking as a whole. So now the fade out comes and text slowly fades out. If you want to change the duration of this fade out or the fade in animation, you can just change it from here. Like right now it is a one second. So let us just change it to around three seconds. So here you can see this dark triangle increases in size that actually specifies that how much duration we are taking. So now let us just play the video. And here you can see it takes a longer to just fade out of the screen. So that's it for this video. In this video we saw that how can we add a fade in and a fade out effect in text. 
Thanks for watching.